Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Dr. John Belkowitz here. We are diving into calculating high range water reducing dosages based on the different types of blends that we're using for this uh, binder here. All right, and uh, calculating high range water reducers, fluid ounces per cubic yard. You might not have to do this on a daily basis, but no matter where you are in the critical path of the construction process, um, you'll need this information. We've got Haley over here helping us out hey, with uh, some numbers. Thank you, Haley. So let's dive into it. So we're going to separate our binder into three different types, and then we're going to use the same high range water reducer to calculate the change in fluid ounces per cubic yard uh, for each one of these different types of binder packages. And you'll see that here in a second. We're going to be using the same calculation, which is this, uh-oh, I lost that marker. Oh, well, we'll use another one. We're using the same calculation, which is that 5.0 fluid ounces per hundredweight times the different hundredweights we'll have for these different types of binding packages. So let's get on with it. We'll start with the cement. So we said 80% of a binder package was Portland cement. 80% of 600 is how much, Haley? What's that? 400, and thank you, Haley, 80 pounds per cubic yard. Now, when it comes to cement hundred weights, real easy. If we have 480 pounds, we divide that by 100 to give us 4.80 cement hundred weights. And if we take 4.80, our cement hundred weight, and multiply it by 5, Haley, do we get 24? So that is, did you double check that for me? Mm -hmm. 24 fluid ounces. Oops, I don't have to rewrite that. That's already up there. 24 fluid ounces per cubic yard. So that was for our Portland cement. Now we're going to jump into our cementitious. So with our cementitious, we had a class C ash. So 80% plus 15% is 95%. What's 95% of 600? Is that 570? Yep. 570 pounds per cubic yard. And to get that, that cement 100 weight, we divide it by 100. So we're left with 5.7 cement 100 weights. And if we multiply that by 5.7 5, 5 by 5, we should get 28.5. 28.5 fluid ounces per cubic yard and our final one is that titanium dioxide and we're just going to call that a binder so now we got a hundred percent of 600 is 600 so now we have 600 weights and six times five correct me if i'm wrong haley but i think that's 30 fluid ounces per cubic yard thanks for joining us today <laughs> hopefully you learned something don't forget to like and subscribe. Share with us your concrete questions and concrete concerns. Go concrete!